So you've lost your ability to smell and now you want to know what can I do to get back my sense of smell. Smell as we know it is one of the five senses and nothing beats that sweet aroma as you come scuttling down the stairs because you want to be the first person at the dinner table or imagine a house full of smelling nappies. Now these are all the little things that we take for granted and smell is something that we now appreciate a little bit more since the start of COVID because as you know Loss of a sense of smell is one of the symptoms of COVID-19. And in a study of about 8,000 subjects, it was found that 40% of people with COVID had a loss of sense of smell. Now what COVID-19 does, it destroys the nerve endings that are responsible for the smell. And this is called the olfactory nerve cells. COVID-19 is also thought to cause inflammation of the nerve cells responsible for smell. Depending on the severity, symptoms can last a few days, a few weeks, a few months, to even several years. And even some people might achieve 100% recovery, some people might have 80 to 90% recovery, some people might have no recovery at all, or they might experience some strange smells. And now the question is, what do I do to regain my sense of smell? Now, a lot of you have heard of smell training. Smell training involves actively sniffing the same four scents every day. You want to spend around 20 seconds on each scent and make sure you concentrate on what you're doing. Essential oils, such as your rose, lemon, clove, eucalyptus are the four main scents that have been researched and tested. I mean, there are others you can try such as lavender, coffee, peppermint and a few other fragrances. So what you want to do, you want to smell train at least twice every day, morning and evening, relax and inhale naturally, try not to sniff too hard or for too long. 20 seconds is more than enough. And you also want to try smelling other things such as spices, fragrances, anything that's safe to smell. And even if it doesn't work the first time, stick with it. It can take weeks or even longer to regain your sense of smell. If you want more information on smell training, why not check my description on some links to videos on smell training and there's a charity called Absent which has good information on smell training. Another natural way to help regain your sense of smell is the use of zinc. Zinc as we know helps to fight caused by boosting the immune system. A lack of zinc can also lead to reduced sense of smell. So taking zinc would help to suppress any inflammation of the cells due to COVID as well as help regenerate new healthy cells. I would advise to avoid zinc nasal sprays, which can actually cause loss of smell, as too much zinc in the cells of the nose can lead to reduced sense of smell. You can either take zinc supplements or natural foods in the form of seafoods, shellfish, beans, lentils, peas, nuts and seeds, and try not to overdose on supplements as this can lead to copper deficiency as well as digestive problems. Now, if you find that the natural options are not working, there is currently research done by the University College of London Hospital, otherwise known as the UCLH, into loss of smell due to COVID. If you're interested, why not speak to your GP? And if you live in London, you can be referred to one of the ENOS and Throat COVID clinics. And if you live outside London, your GP can refer you to one of the local clinics. So what they're currently doing is patients are being offered a choice of zinc and vitamin A, nasal and oral steroids, as well as smoke training. I mean, in terms of steroids, you have nasal and you have oral steroids. Nasal steroids can come in the form of sprays and there are different types of sprays you can try. You also have oral steroids. Now studies have been done on this. So a recent study has shown that a 10 day course of steroid tablets was done in a small number of people combined with small training. And this had better results than small training alone. However, we need a large number of people to verify the effectiveness of this medication. A few patients have reported that their doctors have given them a five day course of 40 milligram prednisolone tablets and they have found that there has been some improvement in the sense of smell. Now, if you've tried zinc, you've tried smell training, you've tried steroids, nothing has worked. There is currently ongoing research done at Virginia Commonwealth University in Richmond. And what they're doing is olfactory implants, which are embedded into the nose and they detect certain chemicals, which now sends electrical signals to the brain. However, this treatment is a long way away from being offered at present as there is still research going on. Now, a lot of us are frustrated because we just can't smell anything. Now, if I cannot smell the cooking, there's always a danger of what if the house is on fire? So I hope this is useful, but what I would advise is no matter how long it takes in terms of months or years, do not despair. You know, continue with the smell training, continue with the zinc supplements, you know, keep doing what you're doing and eventually you'll get your sense of smell back. Now, if you have any other ideas of how to regain sense of smell, please drop in the comment section. And if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.